Hey guys, what is up? It's Espalmer on here today, and today in this video, I wanted to show off a horse tester. Um, I've never tested any of these horses. Um, I don't know any of their stats or anything, so I want to um, just go ahead and show you guys how to build a horse tester and um, show you how to use it. So first off, let's get how to use it. Um, first, let's do speed. So these are the materials actually we'll save that for later okay so what you want to do is you just want to you can either do a running start or you could not do a running start but you want to make sure you run at the corner of these so when it's open you want to run through the um, here, let me put this horse back for a second um, you want to run through this part right here the part that's actually open like right there alright so Let's get back on this horse, the horse we were just on, and let's run at the corner. Okay, so this horse got stuck in the 12th one, so that means they ran a 12. So, if you didn't already know this, pressure plates um, stay down for, um, let's see. They stay down for, I know I saw it, uh, five redstone ticks, which is 0.5 seconds. Um, so, whatever your horse runs, so in this case, if I run a 12, my blocks per second is a 6. So, now that we know that, um we want to know how high the, can the horse jump okay so the reason why I just destroyed that is because all horses can walk over a block without a problem so that's not really necessary so um, first you just do a jump you can make it over a block and a half then you gotta make sure you get in the hole you make it over two blocks two and a half make sure you get the max height okay that's three yep three and a half uh, I think that first one yeah I can't get three and a half so this horse can jump three blocks so that's pretty good um, you can make that more accurate and add snow layers but I don't think horses can jump like 0.5 I don't think there's really that much of a variation so I'll show you again with this horse tell you if there's any difference um, this guy feels like a jumper even though I know he's not yeah, this guy. What? Okay, this guy can probably jump two. Nope. This looks to be his max jump, which would be one and a half, which is pretty sad. Oh, um, let's test his speed. Alright. What is he, a fast horse? Nope. Ran about five blocks per second. Let's try again. And again, five blocks per second. So this horse is not very good. Um, the one other thing you can do is just test their health, which you can't do in creative mode. Um, so what you need to do um, is build this. This is really simple to build. Um, I'm actually going to go into survival mode here, and I'm going to build one right here. Um, oops. Zero. Oops, that's supposed to be one word. Alright, so these are the materials you're going to need for the speed uh, tester. So, you want to dig down two blocks. Um, let me grab a shovel. Tools. Tools. Shovel. Alright. Okay. So you want to dig down two blocks, go over, then up. Come here, 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 with your redstone. Put your repeater right there. Put block right there. Actually, I'm not supposed to be using these. I'm going to put blocks all through here. You should have 14 left. Okay. Um, let me grab a pickaxe. So unprepared. Uh-huh. Tools, 
pickaxe, and that's all I shouldn't be needing now. Alright, so let's mine this up. And now you just want to place the redstone all throughout here, and I think I, yeah, I forgot to do one. Oh, two. Oops. Here and here. And remember, these can be any kinds of blocks you want. Um, and then you just want to go across the top. Place down blocks on all these. Grab one of the dirt that you mined. Place your pressure plate. And everything should light up. Perfect. Then what you want to do is you just want to place down, starting here, you just want to place down fence gates. You're going to need 14 fence gates. And there's no way you can't make this any more than 14 as far as redstone goes and um, you can't make you can't use this design um, just because it won't quite work right because if you put a tick here it's gonna be like if you put a repeater here to do another 14 it's gonna be inaccurate because that's an extra tick so of course it would start raining and um, so let's go ahead and stop that uh, then when you're done with that all you want to do is you want to come over to this side and you want to label it 14, 13, 12, and so on, so on. If you use um, escape, it's faster than clicking done, in my opinion. So there's that. And to simply make the, um, the uh, jumper test, you will need 56 and uh, 56 blocks of your choice and 8 stone slabs place 2 slab I like to leave a 2 block jump you can leave a 1 block jump jump or space in between but uh, just I would do 2 so then do 2 blocks and then do 2 blocks again and then here and here and here and here and here and here and you just keep doing that till you have six blocks till uh, you have one that's six blocks tall which I believe is the max height that a horse can jump and yeah so that is how you can make your horse block horse tester um, sorry I haven't posted a video in a long time um, I promise I want to be post posting more videos. Uh, I want to do shorter videos like this, um, where it doesn't require much editing, uh, little to none actually. So you can pretty much just test all these horses now, and like this one is like a 4.5. Yeah, that'd be about 4.5. No, that would be yeah, it's 4.5, and then yeah, uh, blocks per second. So yeah, I just want to be doing more videos like short. But, uh, quick. So, thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Espalamone. I will see you guys all next time. Peace.